So, uh, it looks like you could do a fishing side mission over here. See this? They've unlocked fishing as a side mission, it looks like. Javier. You can go fishing with Javier. What else do we got here? Oops. There's a new mission here for Mr. Pearson. Pearson needs to speak to you. There's a side mission here with Leopold Strauss. Okay. Maybe more money collection. It could be. It could be more, more money collection. <clears throat> and I'm assuming that I, all the fish he kept, and I can't, I can't donate it, but I'm going to check. We gotta talk to Pearson to unlock that anyway. Let's talk to Pearson. Say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you, if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. Uh... You me, sailor, and I'll slice you up. You put that knife down, or you could be missing a hand. What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. Were those cans floating? I thought they were two floating cans. Yeah, they're floating over there. Look, you can see them in the air. <laughs> My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner. Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife. <laughs> Enough, both of you. Well, come with me then. You want to head out there, run with the man? <laughs> so be it. But we do more than just hunting. Mm -mm. We're hunted. <clears throat> and them things hunting us, so well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe yeah, an explanation for these fucking floating cans around. behind me here. I'm freaking out, yeah. man. Look, he's right there. Right behind him. Here's my list. And can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. <clears throat> Come on, princess. Are you coming with me then, woman? <laughs> so I've graduated oh, the from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> She's going with him, and she complains anyway. A shopping list. Drive to the store. <clears throat> Go grocery shopping! Yay! Yes. <clears throat> I ain't no scullion. And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating halfwit. I guess we all gotta do our share, Princess. Huh. Where's that letter? Well, are you reading his mail now? <laughs> oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. Here. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. <laughs> you are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time. So I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Woo! <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and right. Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you ever actually even talk to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kildall. Oh, that, that's Dutch's idea. All mail to be sent to the same alias. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore or whatever they changed it to. <laughs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. Uh, yes, PFAF, I will eventually try this game online when it, when it does launch. It's not out, you know, not now. It's going to come out supposedly sometime in November. 
I guess we'll see. Okay. Here we are. <clears throat> so, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you... No! You and no. Well, I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws. Not idiots. We rob fools and rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food to eat. And no guns. You're sure? This time, there'll be time no. for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. Go to the post office. We come back, there's dozens dead in the street. <laughs> she slaughtered them all. Yes, I would like to post a letter. Here we go. All right. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Bye now. Pay that bounty? Fuck no. I never paid my bounty. Fuck that shit. Where the hell did we even get this woman from in our gang? I don't even remember her being in the gang. All of a sudden, this random woman's there. <clears throat> No. I'm trying. Try what the hard. fuck? Where'd you get these clothes from? What the uh? Huh? Where'd you get those clothes from? <laughs> I think this is everything. Thanks. <clears throat> Here, take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. We'll give it back then. Jesus! <sighs> I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady, get a move on. I like Sadie, <laughs> not lady. I know. She's the woman so, you saved at the beginning? I don't even remember thing. saving a woman at the beginning. So. When did I save a woman? And some <laughs> I don't remember that. I see. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair making cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. Oh, from the house that burned you down. Gotcha. Okay. Won't be long before you're smoking. That was a long time ago. Playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry. About what you, uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's taking nothing from me uh -uh. ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Hey there! Hey. What, uh. What you folks up to? Just <clears throat> heading home. You're in the Morn Raider country. Keep it cool. Sadie. You need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over. Uh oh. That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Josh, you shot him. Go, go. God damn it! Get moving. They was gonna rob us. Got them both. Good shit. Think you're landing records. Oh, oh here come more. I'm gonna run this son of a bitch down. Oh god. Oh. Put your mama in the cell. You wanted to see some action, lady. Now you got your win.
Not trying to run away. Lady, you are enjoying this far too much. Dude, this guy got shot a million times, still not dead. He got away. Alright, I'll drive us back. He fucking got away. <laughs> God damn it. Probably shouldn't linger here too long. Alright. Are you coming then? No, past those reins here. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble already. <laughs> I'm fine. Careful. Yep. We showed those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. Did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe. If he asks. But maybe not. So who do they All right, say very they nice. Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. Who knows? Whoa, I almost freaked the fucking anyway, wagon. Shit. Don't you go ribbing Pearson about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind of bothers. Not a chance. You didn't get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I, <laughs> I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> oh, we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants, by the way. Yeah, she bought all those clothes. <clears throat> Oh, there's another mission. Damn, there's a lot of side missions that have opened up now to raise money, it looks like. This one's pulsating. A pulsating mission. Arthur. What the heck? Next time we run an errand together, remind me to pack more bullets. Come on, Arthur. Don't pretend that wasn't kind of fun. <laughs> well, I guess. DJ Runo, thank you for the cheer, but I'm not going to read that. <laughs> Come on, man. Gotta stop saying stuff like that. All right, do I have fish to donate? I do. I can donate all my fish. Don't ask. Very good. We were Hang getting low. There. there we go. Very nice. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. So what do I want to do? I got a bunch of missions now. Look, let's see. A new home robbery with Sean. Dominoes with Tilly. And that Leopold Strauss side mission. The hunting mission opportunity has disappeared. So if anything, maybe that means I should do these while they first appear or else they might go away. Yeah, okay. Arthur. You're gonna rob a house with Sean. Oh, hey, Arthur. Rob a homestead. Hey, so, tell me. <clears throat> Is your people, uh, Jacobites or English lovers, Arthur? My people were peasants. We had no time for politics. My dad would say that no politics was politics. That old world bullshit, it ain't got no place here. Why? Because there ain't no judgment here. Most folks hate the <clears throat> Negroes, they hate the Redskins, the Jews, even us Irish. <laughs> you ain't so free of politics. I hate everyone, just the <laughs> same. He's well, an equal opportunity hater. Case, you're gonna want what I just found for no. us. What's that? I was riding around a couple of days back. I come across this old cabin. A couple of fuckers lazing about outside all liquored up. <laughs> I didn't think nothing of it. But then I come across this hunter down by the river. He tells me they're a stick-up crew. Says they hit a train a couple of days back near Emerald Ranch. Nice fella he was, shared a bottle we did. Then I robbed the bastard blind. <laughs> you believed him? No, 
no reason not to. If he's right, it'll be a big haul for us. I saw three of them, maybe more, but I reckon you and me, we could take them real easy. All right. What the hell? Let's go check it out. <laughs> them sons of bitches think they're mean. <laughs> they're about to get a lesson in mean. Cool, maybe we'll make, make a lot you more money. just keep your cool, you hear me? I hope so, because I obviously want to keep yeah. upgrading the camp. There's new things like the boat and other things that are available now. Right, follow me. All right, we're off. Watch it. Good stuff. I like it how it's so, it's so free flowing, and you know, mission flows into another mission, and you really just feel like you're part of a gang, just doing different kind of stuff. It's cool. I like it. How far is this place? It's a bit of a ride. Not too bad. Back up north to stretch. Not far from the state line. All right. So, what were you doing riding around up there anyway? Sniffing around, looking for the take. I got a long nose for these things. Dutch has always honored us to get out there and bring in money, ain't he? And rightly so. I ain't like some of them others back there, sitting around waiting to be told I go after it. I see you sitting around plenty. I mean, I don't need no coddling like the rest. Dutch knows my value to the cause, as from the moment I met him. You tried to kill him, if I remember the story right. And he kept me around, didn't he? He saw something in me. He said as much. I'm sure. Dutch is good at seeing things in people. And while we're talking about money, you are clear on how this works. We split half. Other half goes to the gang. Dutch keeps all our savings hidden in a safe spot outside camp. Yeah, yeah, I know. How many times do you have to tell me? Well, what's yeah. that box by his tent for, then? Camp funds, supplies and the like. In fact, you don't know that. Suggests you clearly ain't put much in it. I always pay me way. Don't you worry. Oh, you're sure you yeah. scoped this go. place out right? Yes, see? That's why I wanted you along for this. You're still a doubter. I ain't just some dumb kid. I've lived a lifetime of shit already. And you sure don't keep it bottled up inside. Nah. What about that train job with the oil wagon? Made a good show in there, didn't I? You got knocked down. Ah, that's what you choose to remember. <laughs> we got paid, we got out of there. Got knocked out in Blackwater, too, didn't you? Uh. <laughs> now that was bloody chaos. He's knocked out everywhere. Did you get split off with Mac? Nope, didn't see him. We lost your boys at some point when he was getting out of town. They caught up with Mac a couple of days after. Davey was finished by the time we got up the mountains. Jenny didn't even make it that far. Those bounty hunters strung me up, beat me, pulled teeth, burned me feet. I didn't breathe a word about nothing. I swear. Good. And it's time folks stop giving Dutch a hard time about all that Blackwater business, if you ask me. The man's not a fortune teller. You can plan, you can use your head. All right, that'll have to wait. We're nearly there. All right, the Hard left step. coming made up. It. All right, it's going to be off the road up ahead. What's up, Moonwalkman? You missed some stuff. We had to move the camp, basically. Oh, then to a further uh, hey. southern spot on the map where we did some fishing and stuff. Some fun stuff. Up here. Easy. Look out. Morgan. What the hell, Morgan? Yeah, what are you doing with them? I'm gonna try to heal my core if I can. Let's make sure we keep one of them alive to tell us where they stashed them. Hope you. There we go. Good. Hope you know what you're doing. Look, there's one on the outside. This is good. It is. Leave it to me. I'll do the talking. 
You hang back. All right, stay behind him. Hey there. Whoa. I'm going to give you and your daddy about five seconds to get the hell off my property, boy. Uh, look, we don't want no trouble. We just thought you might like to know we passed a big posse of lawmen headed this way. There were a dozen of them coming up east. What? Where? Right here. Nah. Stupid. Here come the rest of them. You saw what we did to your pals here. Oh. Hey, okay, I give up. Don't shoot. I ain't armed. If you want to leave, you'll tell me where that money stashed. <laughs> well, all right, all right, take it easy. <clears throat> Behind the, the wall in the bedrooms. If you stick your hand between the gap. All right, you go grab the money. I'll keep an eye on sunshine here. Oh, what? It doesn't work. Oh, come on. The homeowners no, reveal the secret spot. Stick You'll often find the best here. option. Won't be Don't immediately killing everyone you come across. That's freaking lame. I wanted to lasso his ass. They won't let me. <laughs> Here we are. We got some good stuff. There's a body over here, yep. Why don't you see what else you can find, Sean? There we go. Told you we'd take him, no problem, didn't I? You did good. Let's see what the pay is first. Go get Salted the ball by yourself. A proper lead. All right, all right. Some cheese. You heard him, right? He said the stash was behind a loose board in the bedroom. You find Anton yet? Gin and rum. Stay or welcome, do we? All right. A loose board in the bedroom. Yes, hey, Walkman. I did try to whistle there. when I was fishing. I don't think I did too great, though. Oh, look. Baseball card. Or, excuse me, cigarette card, not a baseball card. Who the fuck? Senator Thaddeus Waxman. Prominent Americans card set. Hell yes, I'll take some cartridges. Thank you. Remove the hidden plank, or the plank for the hidden stash. There we go. All right. This is more like it. Good work. Hey, what about my car? I found a place, didn't I? All right, here. But <laughs> don't forget to give the camp its share. Supplies don't appear by magic, you know. All right, don't need to lecture again. <laughs> See you back at camp. <laughs> Never know what folks got. Anything else? I guess not. <laughs> There's gotta be other places out there like this. Moonshine. Alright, so it basically says there's various homesteads in the world that you can discover through different means. Okay. Gotcha. I guess we're done. Where am I right now? Okay. I guess I'll head back. Upgrade the camp a bit. And, uh... Oh, there's a fence outside of town. Oh, no, that's the town itself. I don't have anything I can sell to the fence, do I? No. No. What 
the hell's camp? Why the hell can't I find camp on the map? Camp's supposed to be here, right? Maybe because there's a mission still? What's going on with the mission? Yeah, how odd that the camp's not showing up on the map. There he goes. Okay, it appeared now. It took it took a while, but now it appeared again. Weird. Oh, okay, hold on. There's the camp. We got some stuff going on. We got a major mission here. The gray investigate the grays. And we've got this new stranger here. I'd probably go check out the new stranger. Yeah. Alright, let's go check out the new stranger. And yeah, apparently now I'm hot. It looks like whatever outfit I'm wearing is too hot for the weather, the current weather. So when I go back to camp, I'll have to yeah. change my outfit to a lighter summer outfit. <clears throat> it's draining my health core, apparently. <clears throat> okay. Easy. Whoa. What the, the hell, hell is this guy? are you looking at? Good question. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I'm ruined. Ruined? How so? It's a disaster. He's British, of course. Who wants to see a woman <laughs> wrangle wild animals who doesn't have any bloody wild animals? <laughs> Come to America, they said. Come to the land of opportunity, they said. Sod you, Daddy, I said. I'm going to America to make it on the stage. I didn't want to be in the army. Oh, now look at me. The old git will have a field day. I no. didn't really understand any of that. I had an act. The bravest woman in the world. The animal wrangler. Watch her tame wild beasts. And you were the woman. Of course I was the bloody woman. Look at me. It's what? the stage. Grease paint. Tears. No one wants to see a man wrangling wild animals. And no one wants to see a woman wrangling nothing. Can I borrow your gun? I want to shoot myself. You <laughs> see, I'm buggered. Why? My animals, they escaped. And now I'm, I'm buggered. Uh, what escaped? A priceless Ranjaniki tiger from the slopes of the Hindu heights. A fantastic, elusive zebra from the plains of Ongo Bongo by the shores of the Limpopo. And <laughs> a magnificent lion from the grasslands of Tanganyika. Yeah, I see your problem. They're pretty hard to come by around here. Listen, friend. Help a fellow out, would you? I'm beyond desperate. If you see any of them, will you bring them back here? How? How am I going to bring them back without killing them? A lion or a zebra just roaming around. Exactly. If, well, I believe the zebra's up near Lonard Sod. Distinctive creature that he is. I'll make it worth your while. All right. Madam. It's bloody Margaret, not madam. Oh, my God. All right, Margaret, so mistress uh, of fucking danger. <laughs> All right, so Kate just cheers to Happy Taco Tuesday. Hope these bits help. Thank you very much, Kate, for the cheer. Let's see. Did they put those on my map now, or yeah? Look. So that's the zebra, or the, as he had, as he said the zebra. <laughs> I don't see the other two right now. Maybe I gotta catch this one first. <clears throat> Catch the zebra. <clears throat> Let's go, boy. Yeah. Okay. See if we can catch the zebra. <clears throat> what I find funny, he's by himself. He doesn't even have anyone with him to work. The, you know, the, the caravan, so the whole thing fell over and no one helped him. <clears throat> Alright, number one, Myrtle? I don't know how to pronounce his name. He did. Oh, he's just called number one, Mortal. Okay, thank you. Number one, Mortal just cheered. He said, Thanks for the stream. Gotta know you. You got to know you through detractors. But keep yeah. up the streams, genuine reactions, and never stop being yourself. Here's to many more streams in the future. Thank you, number one, Mortal, for the support and that kind message. Appreciate it. 
<clears throat> okay, onward. New handover, a nice big bounty. 60 bucks. Just somewhere in this area. A zebra. Where's the zebra? I need to catch the zebra. That's not it. Nope. Right? That's a oh, that's it. Oh my god, that's it. It just isn't some mule. It's a mule painted like a okay. zebra. <clears throat> what they done to you? Yeah. It's a friggin' mule. A mule painted like a zebra. Uh, all right, how silly. <clears throat> DJ Runo said, do you change summer, winter time? What kind of nice that your stream start? And I don't know, cut off. No, I'm not going to change. Like, our daylight savings time starts, I believe, within one to two weeks here in America. It's different than, than uh, how they do it in, in Europe. So when ours change, I will change as well. But uh, right now, same times. Riding a friggin' donkey that he painted. <clears throat> so what's gonna end up being is none of these are what he says. There's not gonna be a lion or a tiger or nothing. It's just gonna be animals that he fucking painted or blew shit on. Watch. <laughs> Slow ass donkey. Here comes my horse. Vendana <laughs> says this Saturday we go back an hour. Is that true? Is it this Saturday coming up? There's daylight savings in the United States? Might be. Forever to get it over there, it's so slow. <clears throat> Devonsley Alexander says we don't even do daylight savings in Arizona. <laughs> I wish we didn't do it here. <clears throat> yeah. All right, we're almost there. Can't call him that. <laughs> Although he's as much a zebra as you are a lady animal wrangler. Oh dear, you're missing the point, aren't you? It's an illusion, a trick of the eye to bamboozle the senses. Confound comprehension. Hoodwink your audience? Hoodwink? Our audiences? <laughs> dear boy, don't be so dreadfully literal. <laughs> no one will pay for the truth. They only pay for deception. The allure of the stage. Dreams and reality. Ah. What is the greater conjuring trick? Lassoing some poor beast on the plains of Mumbo Jumbo land and shipping it here so it can dance the polka? <laughs> or turning there in the glare of those arc lamps something mundane into something extraordinary? 
It's the difference between prose and poetry. It's alchemy. We're selling dreams, dear boy. Well, as long as... Oh! As long as you don't pay me with tickets to your show. Ah, uh, yes. Well, it's not everyone's cup of tea. And speaking of my payment... Of course, of course. I shall make it worth your while. But, um, first, we shall need the whole menagerie back before we can think about that. My assistant's gone for the tiger. Tiger? Yes, yes. And taken our remaining lion in case it could lend a paw. They're down there on Caliga Way. Please, I hate to ask. All right, I'll see what I can do. Oh, well, we're off again. <laughs> All right, one down. Find the tiger handler. Caliga Way. Okay, straight ahead. What's the lion gonna be? I can't imagine a lot. The, since he said he took the lion to help hunt the tiger, I have to think that the, the lion's gonna be like a dog or a hound, right? Like a blood, not a bloodhound, but like maybe a hunting dog. What the hell the tiger is? A cat? <laughs> a fucking house cat. <laughs> Bishop, Bishop Makoto says, uh, maybe the, the tiger's probably a pastrami sandwich painted with stripes. <laughs> Alright, so Kate just cheers to shout out to Anana Shark, Jim Bob, Solid, and to Peter Parker. They are the real MVPs. There you go. <clears throat> Thank you, Kate. There's oh, a son of a bitch. Shit. Shoot to kill. Bastard. Fuck them. Yeah. Good luck following me now, assholes. Lost them. Good shit. up here <clears throat> there's a house up here <laughs> thank you team Mariucci, for that very generous cheer 1050 bits he's feel I've been able to catch your streams live recently because I am a manager now but I've been loving the play through you on YouTube thank you very much for team Mariucci. before we do this mission let's update the leaderboard and get him up there as the top cheer of the day thank you very much Very nice. Okay. Aha! <clears throat> uh -huh. Stripey? Hey, mister. Oh. Miss. Howdy, mister. Did, uh, you lose a tiger? Yeah, you found one? <laughs> nah. Found your caravan down the way. Uh, Margaret said that you might need a hand. Oh, you weren't wrong. That tiger's missing. I sent our best lion out to find him, and yeah, and best lion. Now he's missing too. <laughs> it was a right old predicament. Your lion from uh, Timbuktu, weren't he? From Valentine, I think. Valentine. He be more of a kind of dog than a lion, but <laughs> in a certain light, a feller could never tell. Of course. Let's <laughs> ready to go. Into them shrubs over there. Okay. Why don't you hop up on the wagon and I'll see if I can find his track. Okay. That first set of shrubs, that's where I left out of it. I got it. Ah. Got the trail. These are paw print. This way? Bring the wagon along. <laughs> How silly. Looks like back blood to me. That's not good. What's this? Oh shit. Well, uh, the dog's dead. Oh, darn. 
found your dog. Ex dog, ex lion. Hey, boy. Oh, where's the rest of them? I think a cougar took him. Ouch. Oh, that'd be stripey. And I always thought they got along. Your tiger is a wild cat? What the hell? What else? You still need it back? Oh, yes, sir. She's our star attraction. Well, let's hope it wants the other half of its dinner. <laughs> the other half? Let's try to lure it in. Yeah, I'm lure it into the wagon. In wagon. You find somewhere to hide. Oh. Well, behind that log, then. Okay. Jeez. Rubs up. Stay right beside down. the animal, animal handler. Won't be too far away. Yeah, animal handler. Real quick. <laughs> yeah, right. I went out to find a tiger. Cougar, you mean? And I <laughs> end up losing a lion. Yeah, dog. Ain't having any luck. Well, if that's what you're dealing with, you didn't have any luck to begin with. Cougars and dogs. <laughs> it, it ain't what you got in this life. It's <clears> what you make of it. Well, that's very wise of you. Especially when you're lacking the zebras and tigers. Hey, keep your head down. It's coming. Look, I really don't think she'll eat the dog. Like I said, they was friends. Shut it. <laughs> oh, well, I guess she's real hungry. She's feral. I'm locking her in. Close. Let's go. We got her. Okay. Dad, will you? And I'll keep an eye on her. Sure thing. Let's get her back to Mr. Margaret. She's We're gonna go too fast, and so the doors don't open. I would have thought. <laughs> since they was close and all. Well, wild creatures turn on each other. Seeming friendly one minute, dinner the next. Viciousness comes easy. I mean, I should know. I've run with a few of them myself. Is that right? No, not really. <laughs> hey, uh, I realize I ain't properly introduced myself. Sally Nash. Arthur Morgan. Nice to meet you, sir. Tell me, Miss Nash, how you end up in this racket? I, I guess it's always been my inclination, you know? Wild beasts and the like. I met Mr. Margaret, and we got to talking, and... You can probably tell in this field he's the ace of spades. He's a card, all right. It's my modest hope one day to be the world's second bravest woman animal wrangler. Yeah. Well, I'd say you got that sewn up in that sun. You think? I hope so. Top five, at least. It depends on how many more fellers throw their hat in the ring. Maybe one of these days. Best female for the job <laughs> will actually be a female. A female, that's great. Oh, I don't <laughs> know if that'll ever happen. Moon Walker says, do you really think at this time ra random people in the Wild West had time to help people catch fake zebras and lions and shit? I mean, obviously this is pretty ridiculous just for the game, you know. I'm, sh I'm sure back then people tried to pull this kind of shit too, like, oh, it's the fucking tiger show and all they do they would get like a wild cat from the area and paint stripes on it and shit. You know, and people would be like, oh, because they don't know better. Keep in mind, there's no internet, there's no fucking TV. People never saw a tiger, never saw a lion. All they saw were pictures driven, written in books. So they don't actually know what the hell the things look like. So they think that they're actually seeing what, what, what that is when in reality they're not. Right? Okay. This is a pretty funny side mission, pretty interesting. I wonder what we get for it, if anything good. around here when the dust was up be careful or you might get wrecked too okay you know the only thing to do in a dust storm is wait it out 
Mr. Margaret's a lot of things, but best female navigator ain't one of them. <laughs> uh, imagine you're right about that. We was tearing around here, looking for any kind of landmark, when over we go, the whole caravan toppled. Found each other and some shelter, but when the wind died down, the animals was gone. And uh, now they're back. Some of them, at least. Thanks to you. Aw, uh, you would have managed it yourself. I just helped you along. You ever want to get in the sideshow business? I'm sure there'd be a place for a fellow like you. <laughs> I'll leave the professional theatrics to better women than me. Fred Flintstone just yeah, said, What's up, my boy? What's up, Fred? Good to see you. Listen if you want. Aha! I see you found each other. Sure did, Mr. Margaret. Jolly good! Jolly good! You know, tarn and feathering a donkey is one thing. I beg your pardon? It's grease paint. Makeup. But playing dolls dressed up with a wild animal, you're gonna want to be a lot more careful. Strappy eight king, Mr. Margaret. I saw her do it. I always thought they got along. Oh, she liked him just fine. She licked her chops and asked for seconds. Hey, speaking of which, you got any more word on that uh, runaway lion, or are you gonna pay me for these misfits? Look, I'm well aware that we're not Royal Command performance material. Daddy, you were right, goddamn you! But a cow barn in Rhodes is hardly Drury Bloody Lane. You got any word on the lion? Yes, yes, I've got word on the lion. Shit is the word. No. Someone saw him near Emerald Ranch. As you know, we're lately very short on lions. So, I'd be very grateful. All kinds of grateful. There's only one kind of grateful I care about. Yeah. So long, mister. That cash money grateful. Be a dare and fix me a gin. DJ Rudo Chudy said not much has changed. People still uh, still will still believe in stuff they don't understand or know as long as it sounds as kind of legit. Yeah, and people always want to see the unknown, like ghost stories and shit, you know? They want to believe in haunted houses and things. and So I, I kind of get it. They want to believe in aliens and all kinds of shit going on. Okay. Yeah. All right, the last one, yeah. the final, the final lion is supposed to be out here. Let's see what we can do. Gorgeous. Look at the graphics here, man. Absolutely gorgeous. Too good. All right. So this lion is probably just a dog running around the town. Oh, maybe over here? They're putting off a skink, right? Oh, here we go. What's the ruckus, boys? Get back! We got a cursed creature in here! Oh, yeah? It's as big as a mule and as mean as a hellcat. It looks like a lion to me. That's a dog in there. <laughs> a dog? Now, you excuse me. Watch, it will be a real lion. Step aside. It's gonna what? be a real lion. I said <laughs> step aside. I guarantee it. <clears throat> it's gonna be a fucking lion. I'm calling it right now. Yeah, boy. Didn't look like no dog. Yeah, boy. Let's go. You hear it? Yeah. Duck. <laughs> Look what you've done! Look what you've done! Son of a bitch. Uh, I'll, I'll take care of this. I thought they blame me. It's my fault. There's a freaking lion on the loose.
What the fuck? It went this way. Oh no, that's the cow. I was chasing the cow. Oops. Where the hell did it go? Gotta be in the stables. Oh, my God, it's real. Take trophy. Woo, he got it. He shot the thing. He got his paw. Is it dead? I pray that thing's a goner. What a mission. Whoever owned that beast got some pants. <laughs> you freaking asshole. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Oh my god, what was that? It looks like there may actually be, uh... The law's coming, I gotta get out of here. It looks like there may actually be more missions unlocking, too. And the law was coming, I gotta run. Right, because there's a, there's a Dutch mission, there's the Micah mission, I think I see a third mission now that's unlocked. I wonder if you could spare the lion. I don't see how. I don't see how the fuck you could catch that thing. <laughs> You're not gonna get it with a rope. I'm gonna maul your ass. <laughs> you didn't think that it might be useful for me to know that this time the animal was actually real, you moron? Steady on. I clearly stated that we were looking you for... You haven't clearly stated anything in all the time I've known you. That could have been a goose for all I <laughs> A <knew>. goose? <laughs> we'll hardly get them to their feet for the curtain call. Bring on the king of the beasts, on the other hand. And they feel the roar. And they, well, look about as surprised as you do. What have you done with him, if you don't mind me asking? I killed him. He's dead. Bloody hell! This is Ramo, boy. Well, it was him or me. Now, pay me. Yes, of course, of course. I have just the thing. And what a treasure! Oh, it is. God, what is it? Something stupid. You're a lucky man, sir. Very lucky man. What is this? From the mines of El Dorado. As green as the rain. It's gotta be fake. As a clear fake gem. as the Amazon. And as dear as all the gold in the Andes. One man's labor is but a trifle compared to this jewel's true value. Wait! I shouldn't. What would Daddy say? Your Daddy ain't here, and we had a deal. Yes, of course. A promise is a promise. It's fake. It's probably costume jewelry. Sorry, get the wagons moving. And the... waiting for the lion? He's in the great hunting ground in the sky. Good day, sir, and thank you. But we really must be getting along. Yeah, I won't keep you. So long. So long, Mr. Morgan. Wonder if we'll run into them Next again. Time you see me, I'll be topping the bill. I promise. Or at least I'll be on the bill. Lav says my horse is hungry. 
Let's take a look. We'll do everything. Feed the horse. Some delicious oat cakes. We'll brush the horse. Give him a nice, a nice uh, grooming. Really done, boy. And a nice pat as well. Pat the nice horsey. Pat How you doing, man. boy? Oh, Buttercup 2.0. <laughs> Okay, so what do I want to do now? That was an interesting quest line. I don't know what the hell this gem is going to be. Um, so here's Rhodes. So we've got the Grey Investigation and also a new Dutch mission in Rhodes. Sheriff Grey actually went Dutch to go back and see him sometime. <clears throat> okay, More, I think what I want to do is I want to go back to camp first. I'm gonna go back to camp, change my outfit, because my outfit right now is considered too hot. So I'll put on a cooler outfit. I'll probably sleep, maybe shave, and then I'll probably talk to Strauss and see what his side mission is, more debt collection, and then go from there, decide if I want to do that or if I want to do these two story missions. So pretty good. Oh, and Austin NY. Also just cheers said, my guy. What's up, Austin? Good to see you. Thank you. 